Welcome back to Auto Revolution. Volkswagen has confirmed plans to establish a new battery factory in Canada, aimed at supplying components for the Scout SUVs and trucks slated for production in South Carolina. The facility, dubbed a Gigafactory, will be situated in St. Thomas, Ontario, with battery production set to commence in 2027. However, with Scout production scheduled to kick off in 2026, it remains unclear how Volkswagen intends to address battery needs for the initial launch of the Scout models. This new battery plant falls under Volkswagen's PowerCo subsidiary, which is concurrently pursuing similar projects in Europe and Asia. In addition to the battery venture, Volkswagen has disclosed intentions to manufacture electric vehicles for its upcoming Scout Motors brand at a South Carolina plant. This new EV facility marks VW's second vehicle production site in the U.S., exclusively dedicated to Scout models. Volkswagen's board of management has announced plans to construct a new assembly plant for Scout vehicles in Blythewood, South Carolina, with an estimated investment of $2 billion. The facility is slated to commence operations in 2026, producing an electric pickup truck alongside rugged SUVs bearing the Scout badge. Anticipated to generate around 4,000 jobs, the Scout EV plant is projected to have an annual capacity exceeding 200,000 vehicles. Notably, all output will be dedicated to Scout vehicles with no plans to produce EVs for other VW brands, as confirmed by a company spokesperson to Automotive News. This initiative aligns with Volkswagen's broader commitments outlined in its $7.1 billion North American investment plan announced in May. The plan encompasses bolstering the product portfolio, regional research and development, and manufacturing capabilities. The production of the ID4 commenced in Chattanooga, Tennessee in July 2022, with plans to ramp up production to 7,000 EVs monthly a figure expected to grow throughout 2023. The Scout brand became a part of Volkswagen's portfolio following its acquisition of Navistar in 2021, which succeeded International Harvester, the original creator of Scout vehicles. Officially revived in 2022, Scout Motors, led by CEO Scott Keogh, envisions a new era for the brand, with an emphasis on all electric platforms. Keogh's remarks on LinkedIn underscore Scout's enduring appeal as a versatile vehicle capable of both family adventures and daily work duties. While details on the vehicles themselves remain undisclosed, Keogh's words hint at an exciting future of all electric outdoor experiences with Scout.